With all the preset options available to you in the effects application, it's helpful to know a few tips and tricks for staying organized. By clicking on the preset button in the menu bar, we can see the options that we have available to us. If you're looking to import a preset that you created on another computer, for a friend, or something that you purchased, you're going to want to click on Import Preset. Your computer will then ask you to navigate to the preset that you're looking for. I'm going to click on this faded blue jeans preset and click Open. You'll then be asked which category you'd like to house that new preset in. So we can go ahead and select Sample Category. Go ahead and click OK. And now when we go over to our sample category, we can see that that faded blue jean preset is there. To find your preset folder for either import, export, or even just staying organized, click on Preset and then Show Presets Folder. This will then open up a finder or browser window for you to navigate in. Within each category and folder, you'll find all the presets that match the effects application. At this point, if you'd like to, you could right click and create a new presets folder for yourself. If you'd like to reorganize some of the presets, we could, for example, take this rugged preset and drop it into one of our sample categories. You can see then on the left hand side, the rugged preset has already updated into that sample category. If you'd like to delete some presets, you can go ahead and just drag these into your trash can. You can right click and delete there. Or back in the application, you can right click and delete. Another option for organization within presets is by going to preset in the menu bar and manage extras. Click on on one effects and this is another way to see all the presets within each preset folder. You also have the options to import from here and also delete. Those are two different ways to add, delete, and organize presets as needed.